Yeah, we could shoot some hoops, have some conversation, you know? So let me ask you this. You <laughs> self-define as a feminist, which I love, but how does that impact your fatherhood? Because you have a daughter, right? I do. Oh. I got it, I got it, I got it. I got it. <laughs> so did, did being a feminist, like, did your journey speed up when you had a daughter? Um, I, th I think that's what it was. I think it did. I think it ramped up. For me, fem feminism is the, like, radical belief that women are people. <gasps> What? I mean, right? What? It's like, it's pretty crazy. Yeah. I was thinking about this, and my daughter came into the world, and I just suddenly was like, oh, I need to really speed up my learning and really try to understand more how I am uh, contributing to the problem, mm -hmm. right? Because it's like, look, as we know, one in five women in their lifetime have a very good chance of being raped or sexually assaulted. That number is insane. Right. And it's not okay for us to be like, well, but I'm not one of those guys, right? Mm -hmm. It's like hashtag not all men. That's yeah, not okay. Yep. We don't get to say that because guess what? I know a lot more than five guys. Yeah. I know a lot more than five women. And if I'm not having conversations with all of the various men in my life or calling out behavior that's problematic, mm -hmm. right? The locker room talk and stuff, then I am contributing to the world, this patriarchal society that makes it possible for so many women to be raped and molested yeah. and abused. So yeah. we have to like actively be anti-sexist, just as we have to be anti-racist today. Here's my next question. How do we, let me see if I can get this Hit in. it, hit it. Oh okay, How this is gonna be a good question. How do we you, my friend, to just make it so you are men? So now all men will be Justin Baldoni. You don't want that, I assure you. I think I do. Okay, this is what I wanna do. We're gonna determine how many um, copies of your book are gonna get sold. If I make this shot yep. from way back here, you you buy like a lot and then you give them away, is Got that it. what you mean? Yep, yep, for sure, go. I'll do it. Here we go. If you get the shot in. Well, wait, what's a lot? How many are you buying? How many do you want me to buy? I, there's a there's a 0% chance I make this shot. So, Not even. So, uh, 1,000. Uh, um, oh, sorry. 500. How 100, much is your book? 50. I don't know. 25 bucks. OK, let's see. Come on. Oh! <laughs> we didn't agree to a number, though. Hold on a second. 20. You said 20 copies, right? <laughs> 20 copies. 20 copies, one for the group. Everybody watching gets a copy. Everybody. All 20 of you <laughs> get a copy. <laughs> oh, we could do this all day. We could do this for hours. Thank you so much for being on the show. I appreciate you. I love you, my friend. For everyone watching at home, make sure you grab your copy of Man Enough. It is out now by Justin Baldoni. Do it. Thanks so much for watching this clip. And thank you even more for supporting The Underdog. If you want to subscribe to this channel, you can click right over there. For more clips just like this one that are hilarious, you can click right over there. Hopefully, if someone did their job, those things are there. We'll see.